Hello Shannon. Look what I can do with my dynamic dispool system. I'm going to remove two drives. Drive one, drive two. Well, I run a RAID 6, so I can do that too. Hello, my name is Vamsi Kasavajala and I'm technical marketing for Dell PowerVault MD Storage Arrays. And I'm Shannon Lassiter, an engineer on the PowerVault MD team. But, um, Vamsi, what are you trying to prove by abusing your system like that and pulling drives? No one would do that in a live environment. Well, Shannon, have you heard about this exciting new feature we are adding called Dynamic Disk Pools or DDP? No, I haven't. Is it available on my fiber channel system I have here? Yes, it's available on the fiber channel system. It's also available on the SAS and iSCSI versions of the arrays. Well, it sounds great, but I just got this brand new MD4U dense enclosure. It has 60 drives and so far I love it. Is it available on that too? Absolutely, it's available. It's an exclusive feature available on all PowerVault MD3 storage arrays. Well, it sounds interesting. Can you tell me more about it? Yes, so DDP is a new type of disk group you can use in place of a RAID. Well, I'm a traditional RAID person and I'm already super used to using it. This form of data protection has been protecting my systems for years. And aside from the occasional problems that just happen with RAID, it works just fine. So you're trying to tell me that DDP is going to be better? Absolutely. DDP is different from a traditional RAID system. It greatly simplifies storage administration by eliminating idle spares and RAID management. Hold on. No spares? So what happens if you lose a drive? And by the way, check out my system. It's still up and running just fine. So is my dynamic disk pool system. But here's the kicker. How long do you think your system's going to take to come back to an optimal state? Yeah, I guess you're right. It will take quite a while for my system to recover from these two drive failures I just caused. And if I was using larger drives, say three terabytes, this RAID rebuild could take around four and a half days for just a single drive. This is because all of the writes in the RAID group are pounding on one single idle spare. DDP, in contrast, can regenerate and dynamically rebalance a 3 terabyte drive in as little as 15 hours. This is because all the drives are both reading and writing as they dynamically rebalance. DDP also prioritizes the rebalancing of the critical segments. As opposed to a traditional RAID system where the single drive is doing all the work, all the drives in a DDP are working together to recreate the data that we lost and hence it's much faster. So at this point, to further give you hard time, I'm going to remove a third drive. Do you think your traditional RAID system can take that? Yeah, right, Vancy. I'm running a RAID 6 here, and we both know that that would crash my entire system. The only way I could do that is if I was willing to give up 50% efficiency and run a fully redundant RAID 10. And compare your 50% efficiency of a RAID 10 with 80% usable storage efficiency with a DDP system. Now that I have pulled the third drive, the system is prioritizing the regeneration and dynamic rebalancing of those segments that are pieces sitting on the drives here. The magic of DDP is that any sized pool will work. It's not a matter of rebuilding to a fixed configuration. With DDP, you can add or lose disks without impact reconfiguration or headaches. Yeah, so we both know the odds are pretty small that you would lose three drives at one time. I guess it is rebuilding faster, but I think I'm much more likely to need to add capacity to my system. How can DDP handle that? Very easily. All you have to do is take your drive, put it in the system, and PowerVault MD Storage Manager would ask you, would you like to add this system to the pool? Just say yes, and when one click, you're good to go. Well, how many drives can you add at a time? You can add as many as you want, up to 12 at a time. But then you have to restripe your whole DDP, right? No, that's the beauty of DDP. It does the work for you. You don't have to do any of the traditional RAID tasks. The system dynamically rebalances the, the data across all the pools. All you have to do is put them in and walk away. Hmm, okay. I totally get this now. So, I'll no longer need to worry about my system in the event of a failure. And I won't have to keep bribing Kyle, the IT guy, with Dunkin' Donuts every time I want to add capacity to my system. Absolutely. You won't have to waste any time or money on Kyle. DDP, or dynamic disk pooling, is all about creating an effortless and worry-free environment. Once all my critical segments are rebalanced, I can even remove my fourth drive. Beat that with your critical ah. It's okay, Shannon. You can have my DDP as well as your traditional RAID because both RAID and DDP can coexist. And it's a free upgrade.
Oh, free? Like the lunch you're gonna buy me? Ha! I think you should buy me lunch for all the benefits you're getting from BDP. 